about the stopping the ball, the points in the paint for a long time were pretty, pretty <laughs> outrageous. Uh, what was, was that kind of what you feared? Yeah, they do a great job. They're one of the best teams at uh, attacking the paint and continuing to attack the paint. Um, where if one doesn't, they pass it, the next one does. And uh, they did that, you know, tonight on a consistent basis. Shea got to the paint. We tried to make it tough on him. He's, uh, as we talked before the game, he's an all-star. Um, and we just couldn't stop him. Um, but it's a six-point game with all that being said. And we had, uh, we take two threes, two good looks. We uh, missed. And then from there, we just were uphill. A bright spot early on was certainly in offensively and defensively was Reggie uh, making his two threes and yeah. he did a great job on the shade. Reg, Reg was good. Reg was good for us. Um, I thought the guys played really well um, without Luca. Um, again, on the road against a team that's playing well, um, we put ourselves in a position. Again, I think it's uh, 97, 91, and we have good looks. Um, we felt that, you know, we also is down, we're down nine, and we thought we had the rebound. Uh, they come, you know, they get the loose ball and score. And so it just, uh, we were close. Um, and But again, give them credit. They, they kept attacking and they kept to their game plan. On the other end of giving up paint points, I know Luca gets a lot of y'all's paint points. Should you guys have gotten more paint points than you got tonight, or, or is that is, would that be kind of normal in a game without Luca? Yeah, I think um, with the way that we started to shoot the three, um, and then also with I thought C. Wood played well. I thought he played really well for us. He kept us in the game on both ends. Um, we almost played him Luca type minutes in the sense of playing him, you know, the whole second half. But again, on a back-to-back, I thought the guys who started, again, gave everything they had. Uh, attacking, you know, is something uh, that we have to get better at. Uh, I thought Spencer set the table by attacking and finding open guys for shots. Um, it seemed at times, like in the second quarter, um, there were some issues, like I think getting entry passes to Christian Wood, and then he kind of cleared out. Um, what, what did you see from the Thunder defense that kind of like um, – uh, created some of those uh, issues? Yeah, I think when you talk about they're aggressive, they uh, try to front the post. And so, um, you know, for us to, to get better at what Seawood out there, when we make that post entry, we just have to be able to uh, deliver. Or if that's the case, uh, you know, drive it or go away from it to uh, find someone over because they were tilting. Uh, they were giving Seawood a lot of attention. And so it's just being able to read the situation. Um, and so, with that, you know, it's sometimes defenses are different with different, um, you know, teams, and they tilt heavy with uh, with the post up with we'll C. Wood tonight, and we have to flash. I thought DP in the second half did a better job. Timmy did a better job of flashing that. Okay, he looked like he took a pretty good shot in the eye. Yeah, yeah I think he's fine. Um, he but, finished. Up, so. But we'll, yeah, we'll see how how he feels tomorrow. We noted you know, before the game that you guys were hitting the midway point tonight. Given the fact that you have won eight of your last ten uh, difficult circumstances tonight, do you feel like do you feel like you have momentum at this point in the season, or is it yet to be seen because you don't have your your whole lineup together? Yeah, I think we have momentum. I mean, you can't take away the eight out of uh, ten that we've won to put ourselves in this position and. Um, Every team goes through injuries. Um, every team goes through a winning streak or a losing streak. And so we have uh, some games here coming up on just on this road trip. But throughout the season, that um, we'll see where we are as we get healthy. And it seemed tonight that the offense um, utilized like a horn set often. Uh, what do you like about those plays um, with the offense, especially on the night without uh, Luka Doncic in the lineup? Well, you're just trying to put guys in a position to be successful and uh, be able to uh, play make or look for their shot. And I thought uh, to keep Spencer in that uh, set with Seawood or DP, uh, with all the switching, it would get us to the, the uh, elephant that we wanted. And so um, that was just something that we used a lot tonight. Uh, on the roll, I thought there was a lot of great plays uh, uh, rolling to see uh, 
see the, uh, to see Wood and also to DP uh, on the roll with the smaller guy on him to be able to deliver that that pass and to be able to catch and finish. So there was a lot of good things out of that set tonight. Lastly, uh, heard you're going to the national title game tomorrow. Yeah, I'll be there as well. Should be fun. How's that coming out? Um, my advisory board membership of the Big 12, huh? and the Big 12 is representing tomorrow. So nice. uh, why wouldn't I be there? <laughs> you yeah, have purple, I hope. Uh, I think so. I, I've heard they've made a jersey, which is kind of cool. Um, but no, it's, it's to be able to see the national championship game um, tomorrow should be fun. Yeah, thanks. thanks.